Ooh, can't nobody do it like you. Said every little thing you do. Hey, baby, said it stays on my mind. And I'm, I'm officially missing you. I thought that from this heartache, I could escape. But I've run it long enough to know there ain't no way. And today, I'm officially, it's official. Oh, you know that I'm missing you, yeah, yeah. All I hear is raindrops, ooh yeah, and I'm officially missing you, Sagittarius, that is the energy that I just got for y'all, are y'all missing someone, that was a message from the divine. Are y'all missing someone? Or is somebody missing you? Ooh, can't nobody do it like you. Every little thing you do. Hey, baby, said it stays on my mind. And I'm... I'm officially missing you. That used to be my favorite song. Y'all, come on in. Come on in. Come on in. Hit the like button, y'all. Hit the like button. Go on and share this with your family and friends. Because for some reason, Sagittarius, I just got to, woo. I just feel like I got something to tell y'all. I got to get something off my chest for Sagittarius. Y'all, come on in. All I hear is raindrops, ooh, and I am officially missing you. Ooh, what message? I'm just gonna get straight in. What message do you have for my Sagittarius? Give me a message for Sagittarius. Ooh, we got union. I thought that from this heartache. Woo! Okay. Awakening. Nostalgia. Okay, so some of you guys are thinking of someone from the past. Some of y'all are thinking of someone from the past. Some of y'all are dreaming of someone from the past, okay? I feel like for some of you, a child could be involved. Some of you have, this could be between a baby mother and a baby father situation. Because I got inner child here. Child could be involved. It could be a connection that you have with this person. It could be because a child is involved. Um, I got devotion here. Some of y'all are devoted, okay? Something here about funds and money. See, look, family, okay? This could possibly have something to do with a family unit, okay? Somebody's missing somebody. Somebody's money isn't all the way together. Somebody's trying to come out of a bad situation financially, Somebody's going through some financial strain. Okay, let me see what other messages be up. We got release. Okay, some of y'all are getting ready to let, are trying to let go of something. Some of y'all are trying to let go. For some of you, this is a commitment. You're trying to get out of some type of commitment, okay? You're trying to release or let go of some type of contract or commitment, okay? I 
all I keep hearing is, oh, you know that I miss you, yeah. Oh, you know that I'm missing you. What are the messages there for Sagittarius? We got understanding. Somebody needs to heal. Okay. Somebody needs to understand that somebody is going through a healing process or they need to heal. Okay. Somebody may be going through some type of pain or something and somebody is under having, you know, trying to understand where somebody is coming from. But we got awakening again. And then we got separation. See, look, I'm telling you, y'all are separating. We got contemplation. Y'all thinking about this, okay? About this separation, being separated from this person. For some of y'all, this is a person that um, you have children with. This is someone that you've been romantically involved with, with Union here. For some of you, this is just something like, I feel like there's going to be like a separation until winter. Okay. You may not see this person again until winter. You may not communicate with this person again until the winter. Okay. We got separation. Like I said, you guys are either contemplating on this or some of you have already made the decision, okay? Some of y'all have already made the decision that you're going to separate yourself from this situation, okay? For some of you, it definitely involves children or a child, okay, that you are very devoted to. You've devoted yourself to this relationship or this child. For some of you, this is a relationship with the child. This is your relationship with your children. Some of you have devoted a lot of time, a lot of effort, a lot of a lot of your energy into this. This could be a bond with a child that you have. And maybe you have to separate or you have to leave. Um, or some of you are separating in the homes. There could be a marriage. Some of you could be facing like a divorce or a separation. I feel like you are releasing something here. You hope that this person is understanding or understanding that there needs to be some healing. Okay, a healing, some type of transformation has to be done in this situation. Okay, somebody has to wake up and realize something here. We got separation. And I feel like there possibly is a separation on the horizon. And this person may be gone or is going through a healing process. Um, and you may not communicate with this person or see this person until the winter. Until we get around November of December, January time frame. So it's July now. So maybe there's like a five or six month hiatus that this person is going to go on or this could be you okay all right let's see message do you have for Sagittarius for the month of July? Ooh, Sagittarius. Mm. Okay. We got the higher fame that wanted to jump out. Some of you guys may be dealing with the tours or you are trying to be reasonable. You're trying to do things by the book. The higher fame here is structure and an agreement being made. This is also the marriage card as well. The 
message do you have for for Sagittarius? We have the Eight of Cups. See, some of you are walking away. Some of y'all contemplating walking away, releasing something. Y'all let team something go. Okay. This could have something to do with a, a mother, a baby mother, a baby father, something to that nature. Okay, but I'm getting the Empress card here. There could also be like a pregnancy out of the blue as well. But I'm getting that there is possibly like a new a new lover um, on the horizon as well. I'm picking that up as well too. But the Ace of Cups is a new, something new as far as emotion. Some of you are feeling really emotional about this situation as well. Some of you are wanting to leave and to uh, find something new, okay? Some of you are walking away from the church as well. Fall, are uh, walking away from um, um, the, the structured um, by the book lifestyle. I'm getting that as well. Why is this? What's, cro what's crowning this situation? What's crowning this situation? Four of Pentacles. Okay. You feel like this person is holding you back from your happiness. Point blank and the period. Four of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups here at the bowl. So some of you, this is definitely a marriage, okay? I feel like you have been commun in communication possibly with the water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Somebody is stressing you out. I got the Queen of Wands here, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries as well. I feel like there is possibly a marriage here with the Queen of Cups reverse. And the Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups. Someone here could definitely be married, okay? So this could be somebody's walking away from a marriage and going through a separation, okay? Um, I'm getting that <laughs> you may want to cut off communication with, with this person. Or this person wants to cut off communication with you, okay? This, this situation is stressing you the hell out. That this person is not communicating with you or vice versa. I feel like this situation is kind of like stressing you out. You may feel like this person, like you want to know what they're doing. Okay? You want to know what they're doing. Why is this all happening? seven of pentacles okay so this person has you wondering i feel like you're wondering if you should walk away or leave okay somebody here could be having financial issues or there's just issues in a marriage okay there's some issues in a marriage okay why is the seven of pentacles here i need, i want to know why the seven of pentacles here Some of you may be wondering if someone is, um, I'm getting this too, if someone, um, if someone is still married, if so, why they haven't walked away, why is the seven of pentacles here? Queen of wands, Leo Sagittarius energy. You may be wondering what this person is doing. I, I'm getting that. Past energy. Ten of Swords and the Hermit. This is saying like you, someone is, has stopped. Um, someone's been very distant. Like someone cut something off, okay? Somebody cut something off. Someone's got cut off. He was waiting for the right moment. Why is the Ten of Swords here? I'm getting stopped. You may have stopped looking for looking forward to something. I'm getting that as well. Like you you stop looking forward to something. You're waiting for them to offer it. 
Okay, so you you stop looking forward to something to see if they were going to offer it something to you. But they may not have offered it because the Ace of Pentacles is in the reverse. Why is the Four of Pentacles here? The Chariot card. You feel like you feel like this person is holding you back, or you feel like you're holding this person back. Okay. Four of Pentacles is definitely holding on to something. The chariot is for movement. Okay, so somebody here is being selfish. Why is the chariot card here? Yep, six of swords. Reverse. Somebody here feels held back. Okay. Somebody here feels held back. Um, and I feel like it's you guys. You guys feel like this person is holding you back or you're holding this person back. You're contemplating on whether to walk away and leave this alone. Future energy. Or this is vice versa. Future energy. Your energy quite a few cards came out here i feel like some of you are just going to give up on a situation for some of you this is involving a child okay because i got the father card here okay he was in the reverse okay somebody here is going to be giving up okay but not completely i feel like with the world reverse this is saying that you're leaving the door cracked open, okay? Some of you need to go heal, okay? Someone needs to heal here. Someone needs to go do some healing, okay? Why is the world card reverse here? Yeah, see, you're possibly, like, just going to cut off communication. You're not possibly, like, going to respond or answer their calls or reach out, okay? Just... I feel like that's what's going on here. I feel like you're leaving the door cracked open. But by doing that, you are leaving this person, okay, three of swords, hurt, okay? By doing that, you're leaving this person hurt and feeling unloved, okay? Unwanted, unloved. What's your hopes and fears? I'm Ten of Pentacles. Okay, so you want to have something to offer them. Okay, with the Knight of Cups here, you could be dealing with a Leo. Some of you may be trying to work on something to have to offer to this person with the Ten of Pentacles. It could be a gift. It could be money or something to that nature. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here? Yeah, eight of wands, okay? <clears throat> I'm just getting like, you've lost faith. Like, you have lost faith in this situation. Like, the energy of it is like, the momentum of it has definitely slowed down, okay? Nine of wands, reverse, and... The Queen of Cups, okay? Some of you are definitely dealing with the water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Definitely, like, you have let your guard down with this person emotionally. Um, so I'm not sure if you're using this as a, a, a tactic to, to keep you in check emotionally. What's the, what's the outcome? The Empress, okay? Like I said, we got the Mother and the Father card here. We got the Mother and the Father card here. So I definitely feel like for some of you, this involves um, a child or someone that you're close to. Why is the Empress here? 
Yeah, disappointed. Okay. Or maybe you don't like this person. <laughs> this person doesn't listen to you. Someone doesn't like their mother or sister or aunt. But you you feel like this person doesn't doesn't listen to you. Yep. You feel like this person is not listening to you. This person is too tough. Okay, they may have they may come off as the queen of swords, okay? You don't you feel like this person isn't listening to you. Okay. Why is a judgment card here? Yeah, see, you feeling kind of bad. We got the Five of Cups here, okay? You're feeling kind of bad about having to walk away from this situation or having to make a final decision to put someone out or for someone to leave, okay? But you have to make this decision. Look at you guys, King of Wands and the King of Swords. So you had to put your foot down. We know the King of Swords, he's the authority. He's the authority authority figure okay so you had to put your foot down on something you made the rules okay you make the rules <sighs> why is the five of cups here yep the moon okay so you're feeling real regretful like you're feeling you're feeling bad about this Okay, because this is possibly involving um, a family member, this is possibly involving a marriage, or this is possibly involving something in regards to home life. Okay, so this really has you in your feelings. And I feel like for some of you, there could possibly be like some type of separation here. Somebody's getting ready to take some type of break, some type of break, period. Okay. I'm picking up on Libra's energy as well as Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Why is the Four of Wands here? Ooh. Temperance, okay. So this is you, this is you guys' energy, but you like to keep things peaceful. Like you want things to be peaceful. Okay, you want your home and your space and your environment to be peaceful. Like, you want to have balance and order and structure, okay? You don't want this type of energy, okay? You don't want this type of energy. Somebody is speaking very negatively. Somebody is speaking extremely, ne coming from an extreme negative place, okay? Why is the higher thing here? Yep, this is about prayer, okay? Like, I feel like I'm getting like, I'm going to pray for you. Why is the Eight of Cups here? Yeah, see, this something out of the blue just happened with the tower. That's something that just happened like out of the blue. You did not see this coming. Okay, you didn't see it coming. You did not see it coming, okay? Mm -hmm. Two of Pentacles. You want everybody. You wanted everybody to get along, okay? You wanted everybody to get along, but we got you spying here with the Page of Swords. We got you spying. We got you spying. It looks like y'all have to make someone leave or you guys are deciding to leave to keep the peace okay to keep the peace how does this person i want to see how this person feels about you this person feel about my Sagittarius? They want to have fun. Okay? I need to have more fun. 
I know that you are the one I want to spend my life with. Let's take this slowly, please. Let's take this slow. So somebody wants to, uh, you know, have a more of a fun lifestyle. They don't want to rush things. They want to take this slow between you and them, okay? They're at a crossroad as well. And they're being quiet to protect you from their ego, okay? So if you find them in a, in a place where they're not saying too much, they're doing it to protect you from their ego. They feel a lot of love from you, and they know what they need to do. They don't need you to tell them. They know what they need to do. They don't need you to tell them what to do, okay? They don't need you to tell them what to do. <laughs> they know exactly what they need to do. So I feel like this person wants to be in a good place, be in a good place with you, but they don't want you telling them what to do. They know what they need to do. I'm getting like, I know what I need to do. You don't have to tell me. Priestess, how are you being called to step up and lead? Okay. I'm really getting you guys' this energy. We got warrior, warrior woman, which is like the queen of wands, Leo, Sagittarius, the Aries energy. You guys, this energy, okay? You guys are being called to lead and step up in, a, in, in this uh, situation. What part do you play? Warrior woman wanted to come right back out again. The ever unfolding rose, okay? Cracked open is happening for you, not to you. Okay, so it's about how you look at it, how you view this situation, okay? Am I also getting sisterhood of the rose, beauty and devotion, mystic and teacher, okay? So this is most definitely about having, um, taking time to yourself to work on your beauty, be devoted to yourself, um, follow your, following your intuition, getting guidance from um, someone who you can trust, okay? So I'm getting like, it's time to focus on you, okay? Where can you lead? Where, what position do you play in this position? Um, figure out what you can do to make the decision, to make the best decision to where this works out for you, okay? If you guys need any guidance or advice or personal reading, guys, don't hesitate to reach out. That information is in the drop box below. Also, guys, take a look at my merch that's going to be coming across you guys' screen. Um, if you would like to purchase um, a t-shirt or I have fanny packs as well as face masks right now, you guys can check those out. Anything that you would like to donate to my channel, anything helps. Um, as well, guys, I will be going live starting Friday. Okay, so pretty much I'm trying to get a schedule down pack, but I know that I'm going to be going live on Fridays. Okay, I haven't really got a schedule down pack just yet. All right, so to talk to you guys later, ciao.